Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. We are doing a, a Bowman's Best is back. See? We're doing a full case of 2017 Bowman's Best Baseball. This is pick your team number 11 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. The next one is already in the store, so please check it out. It's back by popular demand. I didn't think we were going to get these back uh, for a while, but you guys demanded it. And there you go. On the 27th of Wednesday, big thanks to all of these folks who got into the action. Really appreciate it. And here is the case right here. We've got a number of other breaks close to filling up on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Baseball, football, and even a little bit of basketball. So visit the website, jazbeeshobbyland.com, to check out all the breaks, including another full case break of Bowman's Best. It's just a poster. I think we're going to eventually give those away. Here's the Bowman's Best. Good luck, everybody. Uh, it would not surprise me if we did another case or even two tonight. It's, what time is it? We're still very early in the broadcast, actually. We're still early in the day, so I think we're going to have time to do a lot, get a lot accomplished tonight, folks. Post-holidays, I know everyone's chilling at home. Everyone's got some time off. A lot of people have time off, which is great. A lot of you are flush with some Christmas money which is great so you've spent the entire holiday season looking out for others taking care of your friends and family uh, now and i think it's time to treat yourselves with a little bit of fun folks so keep it up ladies and gentlemen good luck first box four autographs per box this is so if you're familiar with bowman draft this is best, and it literally is what that is. It's the best of the best of the draft class, and it also includes uh, veterans as well, which is another nice touch in Bowman's best baseball. So this is Pick Your Team 11 from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Good luck to all. This is a relatively quick break. We'll be done with it pretty soon. We'll be on to the next break. Got a lot of breaks that are close, so check it out on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Uh, these mirror image cards we will randomize between the left and the right unless it's the atomic refractor. And there's our first autograph, Christopher Cisse for the Rangers. And there are some that are, some of these mirrored image cards are, are numbered as well, serial numbered. The Chris goes to Big Boys 007 and the Rangers. Nice Aaron Judge. We'll set those aside too. And nice Ahmed Rosario, 97 out of 99. For the Metropolitans, that goes to Gerald. People are saying that he's going to be a legit star for the Mets. You Darvish not signed yet. More mirror image cards. And Lucas Urseg for the Brew Crew. Nice one for the Brewers. That goes to Jerry. Remember, Vet Base does not ship in this. 96 out of 99, Jay Groom. For the Red Sox, that'll go to Gerald. But obviously all of the RC cards will ship. Obviously DL Hall will ship. That goes to the Orioles. Scott L. Obviously stuff like that. Royce Lewis will ship. And there's Gliber Torres out of 250 for the Bronx Bombers. That goes to Adam with the Yankees. Adam Kupperman. There you go. Nice first box. Some nice hits here. Love Bowman's best. We did a ton of cases last year. I would imagine we'll do uh, as many as we can this year. So 
So the second box. Good luck, everybody. Thanks for getting in. I'm sure we'll do another case of this tonight. See a lot of orders coming in, so thanks, everybody. Remember, in any break, I think any of the, I think uh, Bowman's best is one of them. There's breaks that say transcendent spot in the title. If you buy at least two teams in those breaks, you'll have a shot. You'll get one entry, one entry max per person per break. You'll get one entry to try to get yourself a transcendent baseball spot from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Now you can buy spots straight up, or you can try to chase hits and try to chase a spot in transcendent baseball. Next box. Good luck, everybody. Jason Groom is your first autograph out of the second box. Nice one for Gerald. Or Jay Groom. Jason or Jay. I think he's going by both. Nice Josh Bell Orange. 19 out of 25. That'll be for the Pirates. Philip, Philip K. Nice Tristan Lutz Atomic Refractor for the Brewers. We had a nice printing plate on plate auto of his in Bowman Draft. Now here he is again in Bowman's Best. Four out of 25 on that Atomic Refractor for Jerry and the Brew Crew. Brewer's doing well tonight. Nice Cody Bellinger. And Tristan Lutz again. Another one for Jerry and the Brewers. And Ryan Mountcastle for Scott and the Orioles. Uh, I have no idea if Flawless will be now. Has it sold out? If it's sold out before anything else, then yes, that will be next. So this is a one per case, the atomic refractor of the mirror image. So we'll randomize that between the two teams, the Angels and the Red Sox. Oh, it did sell out? I believe that probably will be next. I don't think NT sold out before then. Nope. Um, and Flawless is at zero. Nice. So I'll pull, we have more flawless too. I'll post another one of those when this break is over. Um, speaking of this break, this is Pick Your Team 11 of Bowman's Best Baseball. Pick Your Team 12 is already in the store. So the next one is already in the store on jazbeeshobbyland.com. So Nick and Rich saying that flawless did sell out. So yes, then flawless baseball will be next after this. First to fill, first to break, and we just go in order. Usually, 99% of the time. Unless like a one box break fills at the same time, like an hour long break fills, I'll usually, I'll try to do the one box break first. Good luck, everybody. We're always pulling nice hits out of here. 
I wouldn't be surprised if we do another one of these tonight. Aha, see? Hang on a second, folks. All right, folks, sorry about that. Off camera, I was trying to delay this break because the rest, the, I ordered some food from a restaurant and they, they got, they gave him, they gave the driver the wrong address. Anyhow, now, now I'm getting calls in the middle of the break. So I apologize for the interruption. It's a live show, folks. That's what happens. Nate Pearson, Scott with that one. Raking rookies, Cody Bellinger. Nice Ichiro Atomic Refractor and Adam Hazley for the Phillies. That'll go to Rick. Rick Todd Hunter with that one. Good to see you, Rick. Happy holidays and all that jazz. Merry Christmas and such. Ooh, that's a nice one coming up. You guys see that name? This is why. This is why Karen Steele bought the twins. Because she wants to get. That Royce Lewis, what a day for Karen. Big Royce Lewis autograph. She got randomized an orange Joe Adele. She got randomized the Angels in the draft break. So Karen is definitely up big time. Out of 250, Kyle Tucker for the Astros. And John Duplantier for EA and the Diamondbacks. Nice. The Kyle Tucker will go to Rick and the Strohs. And this Cody Bellinger, all those inserts, Dodgers inserts will go to Ashley. And those Aaron Judges will, of course, go to Adam Kupperman. Even those rookie cards and the inserts definitely have uh, future value and, and, value and current value on the secondary market, especially relative to some of the other inserts. For other players, obviously. They're the rookies of the year. All right. Next box. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. 
Oh, sorry guys. <laughs> Another call. All right, I'm back, folks. Sorry about that. Now, we, we, there should be no more interruptions. Finally got the food. <laughs> they gave him the wrong address, and I gave him the wrong cardinal direction as well. I think they sent it to, like, 611 South somewhere in Redondo Beach. Unbelievable. All right, here we go. So, onwards, Bowman's best. Pick your team 11. Hopefully, no more interruptions after. Another Royce Lewis? There's Miguel Sano out of 250 for Karen and the Twins. And Karen with another Royce Lewis autograph. He's the number one overall pick in 2017. What a day for Karen. You could probably grade one of these too. There's Matt Sig Sauer for the Yankees. That goes to Adam Kupperman. It looks like people are in a baseball mood. DJ Remix, r r Remix, grabbing two teams. And NT Baseball is down to seven now. Nice Dylan Cousins for the Phillies for Rick Todd Hunter. So everyone's enjoying the baseball action. There's Alex Bregman out of 150. That's another one for Rick and the Astros. Almost dropping these top loaders all over the place. Nice Bregman, and there's is Kevin Merrill for the A's, Oakland A's. TJ with the A's. Nice Bellinger. And there you have it. Halfway through this eight box break. So a lot of nice stuff popping out of here. Good luck everybody. Jesse O was saying a few minutes ago uh, that uh, Royce Lewis is gonna be a stud. It's, there's an outside chance he starts in double A this season. That's pretty crazy, considering he was just drafted like earlier this spring, right? Or when is the draft? June, maybe? So earlier this, in, in the summer, the draft, yeah, the draft was June 12th. That's pretty crazy. Well, the Twins definitely have a lot of young talent, especially hitting talent, coming up the ranks. He finished this year in low A. So yes, so skip that high A, skip single A, go 
send him straight to double A. Twins definitely have a lot of uh, a lot of hitting talent coming up the coming up the farm. It's it's the pitching. That's what they need. They need that. They need that. Uh, they need that starting pitching. Yeah, TJ, who's all who's in minor league baseball, of course, saying that bats have a higher chance of jumping to double A in their second season. There you go. Next box, and we've got Shane Boz. That goes to the Pirates, Philip K with the Buckos. The Boz. There's Chance Adams for Adam Kupperman and the Yankees. Kyle Tucker in the back. There's Kirsch. And another Chance Adams for Adam Kupperman. So, Adam, you're starting your... Chance Adams PC, whether you like it or not. <laughs> and Trevor Rogers, nice. Marlins. That goes to Nicholas Frank with the Miami Marlins. Nick, this is your uh, your 13th overall pick in the draft. In fact... He was, he's out of Carlsbad High School, New Mexico. Nice, next box. Man, so Jesse O is saying Within two weeks, the rookie league manager said the twins told the twins that he needed to move up. Nothing to prove in rookie league. Well, Royce, the, what's crazy is that um, is that he's a high school kid. He got drafted out of high school. So if he's moving up the ranks, you know, fairly quickly as a high school kid, I mean, th that obviously shows something, you know. So positionally, Jesse, is he going to stay at shortstop? Can he move around? I guess that's the next thing you'll learn. I, I suppose they'll tr they'll try to see if they could. That's what that's what that's what GMs love these days: positional versatility. They want to see they want to see their players be able to play at least a couple different positions. You know, if Royce Lewis has a decent glove, maybe. Maybe he could uh, play it second. Or maybe his hitting will be good enough where uh, he can DH. Right, I think Nick Gordon is in his path, right? Yeah, Jesse's saying it really depends on Nick Gordon and Jorge Polanco. Well, they'll, they'll have a couple of years to figure it out. Evan White, Mariners, before, uh, before Royce Lewis starts knocking on the door of the big club. Mariners, that goes to Daniel Rally with the Seattle Mariners. We've got Max Scherzer taking it to the max out of 250. Joe Johns with the Nationals. Oh, that's not a bad call. So Jesse's thinking that uh, Royce Lewis maybe gets shifted over to third, Nick Gordon at short maybe, and then Sano to first. That makes sense. 
I guess, in, in a post-Joe Maurer world. There's Tristan McKenzie for the Tribe. That'll be for TJ. Nice one, TJ. Yeah, he's, a, he's a big dude. Tall dude. 6'5". Imposing. And now there's usually one vet auto per case or a second year player or whatever. And looks like it's going to be Carlos Correa. Nice. 99 out of 99, Carlos Correa. That is strong. And that is Rick Todd Hunter with the Houston Astros. Not too shabby at all for this. He's on the box. Got the guy on the box. There's Lewis Brinson out of 150. That's for the Brew Crew, Jerry, with the Brewers. And for TJ and the A's, Lazarito Armenteros for TJ. It's an awfully small autograph for such a long name. And there's Will Myers, 30 out of 99 for the Friars. Myers for the Friars, Mike Kuntz. Nice box. Very strong. Couple Royce Lewis. Nice case. Couple Royce Lewises and a Carlos Correa. No complaints there, right? DJ saying, speaking of single A players, that you met Jeter when he played single A in Greensboro. And he says, was a nice as kid as they come. And at a small card show at a small mall. Yeah, those days are long gone. No more, no more card shows at the mall. <laughs> Joe Cavanaugh saying the crowd of the Marlins game this season may not be much bigger than that that particular mall. Yeah, the Marlins. It's going to be interesting to see what they're what how the fans react to what the Marlins have done in the offseason. A um, lot, lot of fans, a lot of longtime season, Marlins men included, a lot of longtime season ticket holders, uh, they, they, you know, they don't want to renew. It'll be interesting to see what the paid attendance will be versus what you actually see, you know, say like in the third inning, fourth inning, you know, right in the middle of the game. So it's, I guess, trust the process. But when you're when you're giving away Giancarlo Stan for for essentially what seems like peanuts, same with D Gordon, you know, then then you start to get concerned about what the Marlins are all about. All right, we know what this is all about though. So this is the second to last box. We love this Bowman's bet. There's more in the store, JaspiesHobbyLand.com. So check it out. Nice Gliber Torres. Speaking of the Yankees and Giancarlo Stan, there's Adam Kupperman with the Yankees and the Gliber Torres. They've got a nice balance between young players and, and the ability to spend money. It's dangerous. Chris Sale out of 150. What are the Red Sox going to do to respond to the Yankees' threat, the growing Yankees' threat, the evil empire growing again? I like these. Nice insert autograph. 72 out of 75. Taylor Trammell. Nice one for the Red Legs. Adam Kupperman with the Reds. There's Manny Machado out of 250. Are they still trying to trade Manny Machado? What's the. We have, have we not seen a case hit yet? DJ is saying, Will Myers and his family used to go to the church you go to. Nice. Then he hit it big time. <laughs> oh, too big for church now, Will Myers? Well, he's in San Diego now too, right? There's a good church scene there. Mitchell White, Dodgers. That goes to Ashley and my Dodgers. 
Boston Graphs meant Mookie Betts. Nice. Jesse says, hey, I like what they're uh I like what they're doing. He likes what the Marlins are doing. But if you're gonna tear it down, you gotta move Yelich and Real Muto, right? Oh, this is nice. This is another randomizer. 31 out of 50 between the Royals and the Red Sox. Mirror image. Joe Cavanaugh says, best mall show, best mall card show you ever went to had a Dominique Wilkins signing. It's pretty classic. Trevor Clifton. For the Cubbies, Jesse O, last spot mojo, strikes again, Jesse. There you go, on the board. And there's Adam Hazley, 32 out of 50. For the Phillies, that'll be for Rick T. Best Jesse's med was, oh, Kirby Puckett. Gone too soon. All right, last box coming up. Good luck, everybody. This has been a pretty strong break thus far. Pick your team 11. Pick your team 12 already in the store on jazbeeshobbyland.com. That is filling up as we speak. I see a lot of orders coming in. And I know that we have Flawless Baseball uh, filled up as well. So that's coming up in a separate video after this. All right, good luck, everybody. Oh, Rich with the with a Kent Herbeck uh, reference. It's pretty solid. When's the last time we one has thought of Kent Herbeck? Maybe, maybe in a Topps Archives break, actually. Signature Series break. I think there was a few autographs of him there. The Twins could be back to their winning ways sooner rather than later. They made it to the playoffs last year. Wild card game. That was pretty strong. They just need some of that starting pitching. But they got some young talent coming up the ranks. They've got a nice new stadium. You know, and they're not that far removed from the from the World Series winning teams of the late eighties and early nineties. So they're not far not too far removed from that. There's Drew Ellis for the Diamondbacks, EA Sports, it's in the game. <laughs> Boston saying, I went to a car show in New York last year before Aaron Judge was big, and he chose to get an auto of Ryan Fitzpatrick instead of Aaron Judge. Ooh, there's the case hit, Gliber Torres, monochrome, Autograph for Adam Kupperman and the Yankees. That is strong. There it is. 47 out of 125. Those monochromes look purdy. They look nice. Haven Smith for EA and the Diamondbacks. I'm pretty sure the Diamondbacks have hit in 90% of the cases that we've busted open. Pro tip. Nice. He's your uh, seventh overall pick out of... Uh, University of Virginia. Nice Reese Hoskins. And watch out there, Dieter, ja Jeter Downs. There we go. Not Dieter Jones, but Jeter Downs. I think this is the first Torres case hit I've seen, to be honest with you, Boston Graphs. Remember when, uh, remember when people Last offseason, they they wanted they wanted a they wanted Aaron Judge traded. Man, where are those guys right now? Matt Sig Sauer, another Yankee for Adam Kupperman. Adam Kupperman doing very well in this break. And there you have it, folks. Nice Aaron Judge, and that is your break. Uh, some randomizers to do, so let me clear away this stuff right here. Got a number of randomizers to take care of. We've got the left-right for these mirror image cards. 
Then we have the one per case atomic refractor that will randomize between the Red Sox and the Angels. And then we had one that was actually numbered. That card is gold, 31 out of 50. Royals and Red Sox. And then we have to see who gets a transcendent spot. If you buy at least two teams, you get one entry, one entry max per person per break. Get a shot at a transcendent spot valued at $155. All right, so I will need one, two, three, four lists on random.org. All right, so first off, left, right, Red Sox, Angels, that's the atomic refractor mirror image. Then you've got Royals and Red Sox. That is for the gold mirror image card. And let's see who gets a shot at a transcendent spot. Let's sort by your first names. So you buy at least two teams, you get one entry. If you buy more, you can block other people from getting entries, which helps your odds. Adam K with a spot, Ashley with a spot, Daniel, Big Boys 007, EA, Gerald, Jerry, Karen, Mike Koontz, Nicholas Frank, Philip K, Rick T, Scott L, and T J. That's 14 out of a potential 15 total entries. Odds are a little bit higher than we've seen before. Good luck. Same dice roll for all the lists. Six and a five, 11 times for each list. Good luck, left, right, first. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and 11 the final time. Left side will get them. So the left side of the card will get the regular mirror image cards. This is the atomic refractor mirror image 11 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 10, and 11. Flips back to the Red Sox. So the Red Sox will get this one. So cool design there. That goes to Gerald and the Red Sox. And now the gold, Royals and uh, Red Sox again, 11 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, and 11. Flips back to the Red Sox. So Red Sox with both of those. So there you go, Gerald. 31 out of 50 mirror image going to you as well. And now, 11 times, name on top, we'll get a transcendent baseball spot from jazbeeshobbyland.com. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and 11. And final time, name on top, Rick Todd Hunter with that spot. Congrats to you. You got transcendent baseball. It's a $155 value. jazbeeshobbyland.com. We've got more fun stuff. There's the website right there. Check it out. Thanks very much. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.